What's up everybody, this is I Try Drawing and today I'm going to be drawing Sombra from Overwatch, the new character everybody's going crazy about. Um, so to start off I usually go with a light blue color. Um, this is only for the sketch layer. I usually start with a circle, you can use the brush tool or the ellipse tool here. Just hold down the shift key to make it a perfect circle. So in the first layer, this is the sketching layer, I usually go with the basic sketch lines like this uh, line down the center of the head so you know where the center of the head is and also the line for the where the eye should be. I go with circles for the eyes but this is just a placeholder for what I want the actual eyes to look like. This is not what they will look like in the end product. I use that just to know where the rest of the facial features should be. And I start a new layer and I go with a darker blue and I do in detail what I want the eyes to look like and other details such as the technology she has in her head and things like that. Um, I do switch to a green color for a second only because I noticed that she has a design in her hair and I did not want to get it confused with the technology and on her head. Um, but I do go back to the blue color and I continue drawing. Um, I would like to stress that you should use references. Some people don't like using references. They say it's cheating, but it's not cheating. It's to help you remember and to see what she looks like or whatever it is that you're drawing, what it really looks like. Because you may think you know what it looks like from your memory, but when you look at a reference, it's totally different. I do go back to my sketch layer and add more sketch lines because I want to draw her body originally I only wanted to draw her head but I changed my mind but I do go back to the second layer again with the darker blue color and add the details such as her clothes and where her body parts are gonna go stuff like that I do notice that it's crooked at one point so I fix it I just use the rotation tool before I go into the inking process and this part right here I'm using the pen tool this is not a tutorial on how to use the pen tool this is just how I draw Sombra uh, maybe in the future I will do a tutorial on the pencil because the pencil I feel is very important. Um, I use a tablet to draw and it doesn't come out as steady as I would like it to be. So I use the pencil to make the lines more precise. And that's what I'm doing right now. Basically I just go over everything I did um, with the pencil and... I do not trace over the sketch marks that I've did. You do not want to see that in the final. You just want to see the outlines. You don't want to see all the preparing you did with all the sketching. So at this point I'm just finishing some inking with the pen tool. I noticed I was missing some elements to her when I looked at the reference I had. Um, this is why I feel like references are important. I would have liked to have done this during my sketching process, but I didn't notice this part of her. This is why it's important to look at your references. You start to notice things. So this is the outlining of the character. I will be painting her in my next video. Um, so tune in to the next one. I am I Try Drawing, and this is Sombra from Overwatch.